Across the country, roller derby is on the rise. We popped along to the Glasgow Roller Derby to find out how the local club is going from strength to strength. My name's Rob. Currently I'm the captain of our travel team, our main travel team. Some people last year um, went over to Canada to play in the first Roller Derby World Cup, um, but this is the first time as a club we went to America to, to play any of those teams, so obviously it's a, a much bigger thing over there. So this is quite a big a big thing for our club to be invited. Our day team have played Edinburgh. We normally kind of were quite similar to Edinburgh and we lost this time, but it was a really close, really kind of hard fought game. Um, our B team recently played Dundee and they won, which is really good. Um, and we've, we've had one home team's game. Um, which which was quite nice as well, and we have a few of those throughout the season, so it's been going well so far. <laughs> I'm the very hungry Splatacular, or Splat for short, <laughs> and I'm the captain of this season. You have five players, one player wears a star helmet, not a star panty on their helmet, and they are the jammer, so they'll start behind the jammer line, and then you've got four players that are blockers, and by scoring points after you've come round the, from your initial pass, the next pass, it's every player you pass is a point. My real name's Callie, but my skate name is Callie Kapowski, and I started in September 2011. When I started, I didn't really know of any leagues other than Edinburgh and Glasgow, but there's, there's like one in like Shetland and Livingston have got one, so they're, they're popping up sort of everywhere, um, which is really exciting because it's, it's more people to play and it's more people to enjoy derby and not ask you where the ball is because people understand there's no ball. I think the big thing about roller derby is that anyone can play. If you're small and fast, you can. There's a lot that you can do, and if you're kind of like big and strong, there's a lot you can do. Some players, like some teams, are very fast and thin, and they're all about moving fast. And then you'll get other teams that are very like strong and heavy hitters, and you'll just see flying all over the place so no game is ever really the same. I'm, I'm not that bruised just now but I'm normally completely covered in bruises and I bruise like a peach but there's a lot of positional blocking as well so you don't you don't have to go for the head but if you do you're probably going to get bruised. <laughs> as I say it's just a really exciting sport to watch. It's very fast paced, it's very entertaining. It's ridiculously fun and addictive as well. My Pretty much my entire life is just how can I relate that to Derby and how can I get better at this? And I have like a book full of tips and things, so it's, it's very addictive, <laughs> but just I love it.